Now, your first alert weather with meteorologist Miguel Hanna Harding. Well, good afternoon and welcome back. We're taking a live look at Grovetown I-24 today. You can see crystal clear skies, uh, just one cloud. How about I move this way so you can actually see it out there. But outside of that, just not seeing too much cloud cover at all. Those temperatures right now are in the 80s. It feels like 94 with that temperature currently at about 89. Current temperatures around the region are in the upper 80s and low 90s, but it does feel hotter than that. We're looking at the heat index around the mid to upper 90s and low 100s, even for places like Millen, Evans, Milledgeville, all right there around the century mark. So it is another hot and humid afternoon. So if you're going to be outside doing any kind of exercise, limit your time outdoors. We are tracking the chance though for some showers and storms as we head later into the afternoon. And those storm chances could linger into this evening, about a 30 to 40 percent chance for those showers and storms today. Forecast highs around the region are going to climb towards those mid 90s. So somewhat of a seasonal to just above average day for some locations. And we are going to be tracking that heat index, staying elevated for consecutive hours throughout your afternoon once again. And we're going to do it again for tomorrow and Sunday in terms of those values hovering right near that century mark. As we head into Monday, though, we do have some lower forecast high temperatures that are going to allow that heat index to stay a little bit cooler down towards those mid to low 90s. But back by Tuesday, we're talking about those upper heat of uh, those heat index values back towards the upper 90s. Looking at radar, though, we are watching this front pretty closely. We're going to have to see how far it does advance towards our region. This front is expected to stall out across the area over the weekend and continue those rainfall chances for us as we head through Monday. Right Right now, though, we're seeing crystal clear skies and not much at all popping up on radar, so no indication of any kind of front near us. And as we continue to look at the water vapor imagery and the mid levels, a lot of moisture out there for sure, but we do see just a little bit more of a ridge over us right now. Behind that, though, we do have a dip in the jet stream that's going to be moving towards our area and could help enhance those rainfall chances as we head through today. Uh, into the weekend, though, those rainfall chances do tick up heading into Monday, especially, and we're going to have to watch out Monday maybe for the threat of some severe storms. But for for today, as we continue through your afternoon, we're going to see maybe a few clouds starting to pop up as that front continues to move closer towards our area. And then we'll have that chance later into your afternoon and evening for some of those pop up showers and storms. And these rainfall chances could last into tonight. So if you have any plans for your late afternoon into the evening and portions of tonight, be sure to have that rain gear with you for sure. But here's a look ahead to Monday. As I mentioned, we are going to have to watch out for some stronger storms that could pack a punch. A slight risk does include all of South Carolina, all of North Carolina, and then most of Georgia. So a pretty widespread risk there. Two out of five chance for all modes of severe weather at this time. And we do have to watch out for some heavier downpours that could lead to some flooding issues for our Monday. The Weather Prediction Center also on board with the threat of some heavier rainfall. Rainfall totals over the next five days don't look overly impressive. We're going to see those in between about a quarter of an inch on the low side to maybe closer to an inch, but some locally higher rainfall totals will be possible if you happen to see consecutive downpours over the same areas uh, or anything like that. So keep the umbrella nearby for today and through the weekend going to have to watch out for those hit or miss showers and storms by Monday. Rain chances a little bit more widespread and those temperatures only in the upper 80s. Thanks, Mikhail. More extreme heat.